Good evening from the TTC parking lot. It is December 1st and we are here for Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party. We just spent about two weeks in Ohio visiting family and friends for the Thanksgiving holiday. So it has been a minute since we've been to the parks and we're really excited to come back and kick off the holiday season. So come along, let's go have some fun, eat a lot of cookies, drink my one and only eggnog for the whole year and see my absolute favorite, the reindeer in the parade. Let's go. I like that they did it horizontally. Just something a little different. So when you first start, you actually go to the right here by Tony's. But look at how cute the tree is. But yeah, you go down this way and get your ornaments. little ornament that they give you. Now on to the fun. We're about to meet the toy soldier. Uh -oh. about here. Mm -hmm. Definitely not. Last time we were here, so we're not gonna do it tonight, but it's really cute. 
And then over here on the speedway, they do all these little fun decorations. We'll ride this one a little bit later. I love this at Christmas time. It's so adorable. So the cookies that were in Tomorrowland were chocolate chip and gingerbread. We just did a photo pass with the wand where it looks like a peppermint stick behind us. I'll insert the photo here. And now we are on our way for more cookies, more photo pass, maybe some rides. We'll see what we're gonna get into next. Here's Ariel and Prince Eric. Over by the castle, you can see here we have Snow White and then Cinderella. The lines aren't too bad for them. I mean, more than what we will wait, but if you are a character fan of all the princesses, the party's a great time to meet them. Next cookie stop. Last year we didn't have a red velvet, but this year they had a red velvet cake cookie at Pinocchio Village House, so I'm excited to try this one. We have successfully hit every cookie station. The eggnog was actually kind of disgusting because it was too sweet. No sugar cookie this year. No sugar cookie, I don't know. But instead it was the red velvet cookie, So, which I actually ate, and that one was really good. It was more cakey than cookie, it wasn't as dense. So now, we've done a couple of photos. We're gonna go do pictures in front of the big tree in the castle. And we wanna try to get that done before the first parade, which is at 8.30. We're gonna do the second parade at 11 instead. And while that first parade is going on, we're gonna try to hit up maybe the Speedway Haunted Mansion as well, because it has the new hat box ghost. We haven't seen that yet. And we'll kind of see how much time we have left before the fireworks, which are at 10 o'clock. So right now it's just a matter of taking in the Christmas ambiance and enjoying it. I don't know. What do you think? It feels very crowded to me tonight in comparison crowded. to last yes, year. Yeah, I definitely think they sold more tickets this year, but still having a lot of fun. Cookie lines are really short. I'm guessing character lines are really long. I wouldn't mind meeting the seven dwarfs, but it was 70 minutes before and I'm not waiting that. So let's go get some more photos. Also too, if you are coming to Magic Kingdom outside of just a party day, save Jingle Cruise for when you're just doing your regular ticketed event because it's not party exclusive. So use your time more wisely during the party to do other things that you wouldn't get to do during the day. So we're skipping it tonight. I don't know if we'll get back here in time to do it before the end of the holiday season, but you know, if that's something that's important to you, just try to prioritize. We just finished pictures by the tree. And now, if you can't tell by the noise, we are gonna do the speedway. I'm so excited for this. It's just so cute.
wasn't anything. It was just the regular like Tomorrowland music. I don't know if it's because the parade is happening or not, but it was still fun. It's still really cute. Highly recommend. We're gonna go see what the wait is for the Seven Dwarves and then from there head over to Haunted. Seven Dwarves was 90 minutes, so we're not gonna wait for that. I, yeah, we're not like huge character people. I love Dopey just from running the races, but not enough to wait in a 90 minute line. So we're gonna head over to Haunted. It says it's a complete walk on right now and we're gonna hope that that stays true by the time we get over there because the parade will have ended at that section. So with our luck, it'll probably jump up a little bit, but we have time, so. Ghost host. <laughs> our tour begins here in this gallery. Here where you see paintings of some of our guests as they appeared in their corruptible mortal state. Most as though you sense a disquieting metamorphosis. Is this haunted room actually stretching? Or is it your imagination? Mm -hmm. Of course, there's always my way. <laughs> Serpents and spiders, tail of a rat, call in the spirits wherever they're at.
fireworks. What did you think about fireworks? Very good. I like them. Yeah, same as last year. Very cute. They're only about 15 minutes long, so pretty short and sweet. Uh, now we're sitting on the curb, waiting for the parade. We have a little bit of time, figured we'd grab a spot, but we kind of did everything else we wanted to do while we were here. So we're just gonna relax for a little bit and then my favorite reindeer are gonna come back and then we will be calling it for the night. So we're just enjoying all of the snow. I'll show you guys here.
wrap on the Christmas party. It was a wonderful evening. I'm even losing my voice a little bit. Uh, did you have a good time? Yes, it was very fun. It was worth the money. The wait lines are pretty short. Um, the way that we did it was we grabbed the cookies first, went to the off stations. Yeah. Did that first, took a few pictures, then did the rides, and that seemed to uh, work pretty good. Because it seems like a lot of people went to the rides first, and then kind of did the uh, stations after. Because as we were walking to go to do the rides, a lot of the cookie stations lines were much longer than when we got in line originally. By like, they were like quadruple longer. Like yeah. We didn't wait in any lines for cookies today. And then also, if you can do the second parade, there's gonna be just so many less people and the crowds are so much lighter. You have a much better option of seating. We were able to get on the curb. We just watched the fireworks, went right over, sat on the curb for a little bit, chilled out until the parade started, and we had a great view, so it was nice. Uh, everybody kind of started to push at the end to leave. We didn't stick around. I have an early morning run. We're tired, it's Friday, it's been a long week, so we're ready to go back and relax. So we're heading back to the hotel, which I don't know if that video will be coming out before or after this one, but I am going to show you the hotel we're staying at, um, do a little hotel tour and room tour. So keep a lookout for that as well. So don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and comment below if you're going to the Christmas party or Jollywood nights. We're doing next week Jollywood Nights and the Candlelight Processional. So more videos to come of the holidays here in Disney. So stay tuned for that. But otherwise, have a great rest of your day and we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.